Yo, what's good, YouTube? Today's video, best badges for a glass cleaner. I'm gonna have y'all boys out here shooting like me. Uh, for example, this is my three point rating right here 65.8, mostly higher than PGs if you want to call it play shots whatever you want to call it but I have a higher three point percentage than a play shot I actually do play on a play shot which I don't miss on but this video y'all is going to be shooting like me not missing I'll show you guys the best badges and I'm pretty sure I showed you guys the jump shot I've been you can go watch the jump shot video I used the same jump shot from day one on this build oh um, Let's get right into it. Alright, um, for my first batch, I use, um, Sniper. Sniper is one of the best badges in the game. I still feel like to this day, Sniper shouldn't be in the game. Because it's just OP. Like, literally. You could have Sniper on Bronze, Silver. Like, you're still gonna make consistent whites off Sniper and consistent green. Alright, for um the next batch setup, I I like to go with stop and pop. I keep this on silver. Oh, this is really good. Say like you want a quick stop. Oh, stop and pop will help you. Oh, oh yeah. And if you like pick and pop, like if you play that play stuff, stop and pop will help that too. Oh, um, the next setup. Oh, um, I like to go with Hot Zone Hall of Fame and Green Machine Hall of Fame. Hot Zone has always been good every year. Oh, you know it's going to boost up your shot if you stand in your Hot Zones. I believe if you go in your uh, My Player Settings, you can see your Hot Zones for that. I guess shows your hot spots, but my hot spots is all around the court. I can show that if you want. And green machine. Oh, you really don't even need this on Hall of Fame, but I'm gonna keep it on Hall of Fame. I do plan on switching this up and putting on something else, like clutch shooter or um limitless spot up, but I run green machine hall of fame. Yeah, that nigga playing weird. This sleeve, they gave me an 83 ball. Okay, here's a big one. Um, corner specialist versus catch and shoot. I really don't, personally, I don't like catch and shoot. So what you can do, you can substitute corner specialist for catch and shoot. I feel like you, if you know how to shoot good, or this is like a useless badge and corner specialist, you just gonna make everything in the corner. You literally not gonna miss. You don't need catch and shoot on poppers, cause yeah, if you really good, you don't need it. And the last one is I put blinders Hall of Fame. This is actually my setup right here. I really don't, ch I haven't changed this at all throughout the six months in the game. Uh, yeah. If you want, like I said, you could take off Green Machine. You could drop that down to the br uh, bronze or silver. And you could throw on Dead Eye and uh, Limitless Spot Up. I am going to try this set up, like, pretty soon. But this is what I run for now. And uh, this is my defensive setup. Um, 
I haven't changed anything. I'm Tonk. I like to put on Ball Stripper. This is a really good badge. Um, but I run clamps because I play twos and most of the everything on the twos, people hop on ISO bills. And if you don't have clamps, nine times out of ten, I'm gonna keep it real. You're gonna get shit on. You need clamps if you're gonna play the twos. But if you're on the threes, um, what you could do is you could just um, you know, hustler. Say like you get a rip or something or your teammate get a rip. Hustler is a really good badge. Oh, you can throw on ball stripper and if you want you can throw on pogo but this is what I use because I'm a twos player. Clamps, chase down, brick wall, box, interceptor, terminated menace and it's a really good badge too. Oh, pickpocket, air protector, you go chaser. And uh... I'm pretty sure this is all I can show you guys for now. This is my build again. Oh, uh, I got a gym rat. Oh. Uh, I haven't really been playing much. I'm only a 27. Um, I'll be honest, this season of TK is boring. Like, we don't have any good events. Hopefully, TK feeling generous. Give us better events than these. I wish 2k can go back to um the old system to where you can get superstars, elite, and legend. Cause 9 times out of 10, everybody that plays the 2s are boosters. Where they just gonna run off of a level. And levels is boring because 1 or 2, like starting out levels... Oh, they go up really fast and you get no excitement. I mean, you get no excitement wrapping up really fast. I used to get excited, oh. Um, I used to get excited wrapping up just the Superstar 2 or Superstar 3, if that makes sense. Because, like, you actually have to grind the game to be good. Or even wrap up if you want to hit, get Elite Pants. But, um, yeah, I'm going to end this video off. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, follow me on all social medias. Um, let me know in the comments if you guys enjoyed this video. And I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Peace.